Okay guys, did some 0 to 60 runs for you. Some of them were pretty pathetic, none of them were great. Uh, so I need you guys' advice on how to get those down just a little bit. Uh, I'd like to get down into the mid fours, that'd be great, or anywhere in the fours would be great right now. So anyway, give me some advice down below guys. And uh, here we go, here's the videos for you. Thanks for watching. Hello everybody, hello YouTube. Sunday morning here in Mexico where I think I'm gonna to try to do a couple of 0 to 60 runs and see how we do so let me get turned around here see if we can get a decent I've only tried this once with the uh, you know with a thing on the car that does a 0 to 60 times and it didn't do very well because I got it all out of you know I got the I got the rear end all out of whack I got I started off way too too high RPMs and, and uh, you know spun the tires and got all crazy so didn't do very well so we'll try it here in a second see if I can get a little better time and you guys can laugh at me for my shitty driving my shitty zero to 60 times looks like we're safe there's no one behind us got a 5.7. That was pretty bad. Got the rear end all out of whack that time, so uh, we're going to come up here, wait until there's no traffic again, and then I'll, I'll give it another shot, see if I can do at least a little better. That's pretty bad. I felt like I took off too slow on that one, so then I almost gave up on it, and then I decided to go ahead and go for it, so that didn't help. So we'll see. Let's see if I can do a little bit better this time. That was a 5.7. I got a 5.5 when I got the rear end all out of whack. So now I got a car behind me now. Dang it. Two, I think I got a clear road now. Okay, 5.3. A little bit better. Well, that's my third attempt at it. I got a 5.3, so I don't feel too horrible. I'd love to get down in the four or something. That'd be great. Uh, my driving's not the best. That was in sport mode. I've seen other people do a little bit better just in the normal mode, so in the default drive mode with a little bit of traction control. I, I didn't really lose traction there just for a split second, so hopefully I can get down into the four, so that'd be cool. Uh, 5.3 for my third try. I don't feel too horrible now. The first couple were pretty pathetic. That one wasn't as bad. We'll see if I can do a little bit better. I'll give this one more try today here. I don't want to attract too much attention, but there's a lot of traffic out here today. For a Sunday, way down here in this part of Mexico, there's usually not that much traffic. A lot of Mexicans coming back from church, I think, is what this is. It's 11.30 in the morning almost, so... Let's give this another try. I'm gonna get turned around and go the other way. Or I could do it right here, I suppose. Let's try it right here. We'll just try it right here. Still in sport mode. Okay, 5.2, 5.2. So I'm steadily improving at least. Uh, let's see, man, I sure would like to get into the fours. I'm gonna go uh, try this one more time, see if I can get down into the four second anything. I'd be happy with a four anything right now at this point. So um, I see that uh, you know professional drivers left like I think Road and Track guy got a 4.1, and I'm not sure if that was an automatic or a, probably an automatic. But anyway, so I mean I can see it's plausible. Somebody who knows somebody who knows how to drive a lot better than me and has a lot more experience and practice at it. Uh, and I've seen lots of just regular guys like myself on YouTube. I can't think of the names right now, sorry. A lot of guys that I subscribe to, and, uh, and I see them getting like four threes and four fives and stuff like that. So obviously it's it's plausible and it's it's uh, it's it's out there. I just have to get there. So uh, yeah, pretty happy with that uh, five two for now. I'm gonna turn around and try to get a four or something, and then probably give it up for the day before I attract too much attention. Some of the Mexicans down here are a little cranky. Some of the older ones down here in Mexico. 
try here, guys, if I can get clear traffic for a second. Uh, I turned sport mode off, which is in regular default mode now with some uh, traction, control, traction control on. So uh, we'll see if that gives me a little, a little bit better traction, maybe. Maybe I get a little bit better time. I'm just going to mess around with some different settings and see what works best for me. And I think I can go. Let me get past this train. Not all the way past it, but past the uh, engine here. Okay. We're going to give it a try. This is with, uh, with sport mode off. Regular default drive mode. I shifted too early. 5.6. Damn it. Okay, one more try. Okay, I got a 5.1. So I feel pretty confident I can get down into the fours with a little practice. Got just a little bit loose there, but not too bad. 5.1, not too bad, guys. I think I'll uh, call off the 060 to runs for the day. I got a lot of people looking at me going back and forth here, wondering what I'm doing. and. Where I live down here in Mexico, where I come down here in Mexico, the people are very, very nosy and they like to, uh, they don't have much going on in their lives except waiting to die. So they call the police over everything. So uh, I don't want the Mexican police coming after me today, so I think I'll call this off. Gave you a little cold start video to begin with. A couple zero to 60 runs. I hope that wasn't too bad, guys. A couple of those are pretty embarrassing. Go ahead and flame me down there for my uh, terrible driving. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my videos. And of course, comment, comment, comment. I love those comments, guys. And uh, give me some advice. How can I uh, just practice more or uh, any, any specific advice for getting down into the fours? I'd love to get down into the fours on those zero to 60s, which I'm pretty confident I can, but I always look to you guys for advice. I know there's lots of guys out there who know a lot more about this stuff than me, so I appreciate that, guys, when you give me advice, I really do. There's a few of you in particular that uh, talked to me about the car and about getting it, the whole process. I've had a lot of advice and a lot of help from a lot of you guys. I want to thank you all for that, man. I really appreciate it. So, uh, thank you. Anyway, I'll see you later, guys. Comment down below. Take care.